welcome back to day four of seven days of holiday slay it's your girl jungle naps and i am here with a heavy heavy slayful look for today so i was just like really 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 feeling glitter in my mind last night i was like what what could i do that's just a little bit different for me and i was like glitter because I'm usually a bit scared of glitter, you know, it gets everywhere, but uh, I came up with this gorgeous look right here, and I am super feeling it hard. I feel like I gotta, like, go out and, like, show my makeup off, you know? <laughs> So if you're brand new here, please don't forget to subscribe. And for all my oldies but goodies, hey, it's nice to see you back again. Don't forget to give this a thumbs up and leave me a comment giving me any suggestions for looks that you want to see for the rest of the seven days of holiday slay. And uh, let's just, let's not mess around. Let's, let's get like right to this tutorial. So for today's look, I was really inspired by glitter. I was like, you know what? I just have so much glitter. I really want to play with it. And what better than a holiday makeup tutorial than to do that? So first off, since this can get kind of messy, I'm going to go ahead and put some tape so I can make sure that I have some sharp lines when I'm done with the eye look. I'm using painter's tape here. I like to put it on my hand first just to make sure it's not as sticky. Sweet, so now that that's done, I'm gonna go ahead and apply an eye primer. I'm using, what else, the Smashbox 24 Hour Photo Finish Eye Primer. And as always, you know I gotta set that primer with a flush toned eyeshadow. So I'm taking Burlap and gotta accentuate the P, <laughs> burlap. And that's from my Lorac uh, Pro Mega 2 palette. But you can use whatever you have around. Doesn't really matter what exact shade, as long as it blends with your skin tone. So my plan is I wanna apply my main lid color from here all the way to about, you know, this part. I'm gonna leave this outer part for the black liner that will be, sorry, the black shadow that we'll be adding. I'm going into this little color right here. It's Ya from the uh, Nubian 2 palette from Juvia's Place. <laughs> and I also realized that I forgot to add a transition color. That's super, super important. I'm using the color Madagascar and I'm going right into my crease. Ah oh, yeah, now for the exciting part, I've got this NYX glitter and for the glitter glue, I'm using Lit Cosmetics Glitter Base and that's really going to make it stick to uh, the eyeshadow that we added. So first I apply the glue to where I want it and I just work in sections so that I make sure that the glue doesn't fully dry before I'm able to add my glitter. For the outer lid, I'm going to add this MAC pigment right here. This is called Dark Soul. Ooh, I love that name. <laughs> so I like to do this by pouring a little bit of this into the cap here. And then I'm going to add a clean, flat brush and I'm gonna dip that in there and add it to the outer edge. Basically, I really wanted to intensify this, so I brought kind of a little bit of that black shadow gently over into the middle, and I really, really smoked this out, and I think it just looks stunning. So now I'm going to take off the tape, and then I'm just going to use a makeup wipe to clean up any leftover glitter. Now we're going to go ahead and move on to the face. I'm using the Hangover RX Primer. Really good for dry skin during the holiday season. I'm adding this to the outside 
well just my cheeks and my chin area and of course I gotta add my favorite mattifying primer to my forehead and down my nose which is where I get the most oily Then we're going in with this foundation it's the Vanish Hourglass foundation I use this all the time on my channel and I like it because it's pretty full coverage yet it still looks like your skin you know what I mean it doesn't look like cakey or anything like that it just blends very very beautifully and I'm taking this Luxie 532 brush it's a round top blender to just blend everything into place for concealer I'm going in with the naked skin concealer from Urban Decay and this is the color dark golden so a really good tip when you're trying to match your foundations and your concealers, make sure that they have the same undertones. If you have golden undertones in your foundation, make sure your concealer has the same undertones. If you have pink undertones in your foundation, make sure your concealer has the same and vice versa. And now I'm taking the SLS Miss Glam Beauty Blender and I'm going to go ahead and just blend, blend, blend. For some reason, your um, eyeshadow isn't as like cut. You can always use your concealer to clean it up. And I'm very lightly taking my setting powder and just going over those areas. I don't really feel like I want to bake today. To warm up the face, I'm using the Guerlain Terracotta Bronzer in shade 9. I love this bronzer. The only thing is it's just, it's so freaking expensive, but it's so finely milled. Like, it's definitely quality. Like, you get what you paid for, you know? And then I'm gonna snatch my nose up real quick, do some contouring. And for blush today, I'm gonna try something a little bit different. Yesterday, I used Nude Sticks uh, Lip and Cheek Pencils. I'm using a different color, it's called Royal, and I'm actually going to use this to apply it like, it's like a creamy consistency, so like a cream blush. So I'm going to try applying just small little dots, and then I'm gonna buff it in. Okay, so honestly, I mean the color payoff is just like barely there. I'm gonna add another blush on top of that. I just had to go back to Old Faithful, you know? My Shea Moisture blush, the pigmentation, whoo, never fails me. Whoo, now it's time to get that highlight poppin'. I've got my Tarte, uh, what is this, the Pro Glow Kit. And I think I'm gonna mix a little bit of Lit and Fire it together. And I'm using the SLS Miss Glam Highlight Brush. Dang, gotta love that glow. I think it looks uh, really nice if I do say so myself. I'm really feeling today's look. I'm going with a deeper brown, so I'm using uh, the Kylie Cosmetics True Brown Liner first to line all my lips, and then I'm gonna go ahead and hit it up with the liquid lipstick. All right, so that's a wrap for this holiday look. I have to say I'm really, really happy with the way it turned out. I just kind of was like, I want to do glitter. Let's just do it. <laughs> and I think it came out really um, lovely. If you guys have any questions or any looks that you would like to suggest for the remaining days, please put them down below. And as always, y'all know I love you guys and um, come back tomorrow for day five. Bye.